Kinderdake. Max and I visited Kinderdake last Saturday. I'm sitting outside again at the moment on my deck and behind me I've got a river. I'm just There you go. And it could possibly be that we've got some noisy boats going by so just excuse the noise but at least you know what it is. We had a lovely day there. It was a long day because the trip took a lot longer than uh, anticipated because there was a problem with the ferries. And when we got home I was had it, I can tell you. But it was fun. It was good, interesting and a phenomena that when you come to the Netherlands it's sort of like you've got to have seen it. Um, interesting to be able to explain how our water system worked all those years ago and the new changes in it now. I didn't get too technical but it was just enough to be able to explain um, how we keep our feet dry. And it was lovely and it was nice to explain it to him. He's the fourth of my grandchildren to be to Kinderdake. We three of them were here a couple of years ago and I wasn't into making videos then. But I'm really quite proud that um, my grandchildren are learning all about their heritage and the things that are important to this country um, and to me while I live here. And um, it kind of fills a lot of educational gaps. Anyway, Kinderdake. The film turned out a lot different than I anticipated. I apparently pushed some buttons that I didn't know existed, but I've left it in there. So I hope you enjoy it. Um, as all videos, I keep learning and I keep finding new ways of doing certain things. So, oh well, see for yourself. I hope you enjoy it. And do you know what? I hope it's just made you curious enough to go and want to visit it yourself one day. There you go. Go for a walk along Kinder Dake.
And what did you think of it? Was it alright? Did it um, give you enough insights into those 19 windmills keeping our land dry and our feet dry and our stock dry in bad weather or serious flooding? Anyway, that's what it's all about. Uh, Kinderdake on the World Heritage list um, and certainly well visited. Bus loads of people every day. Whether the weather is fine or not. Anyway, this Oma loved taking her faraway grandson for a walk to the windmills. One tick and another another tick in the box. And um, the next few videos will also be those ticks in the boxes. His time here is running short. We've still got a few things to do. Got a few things in the offing. It's okay. Paris, here we come in the weekend. Looking forward to that too. Okay, it's all my far away signing off. I'm not that far away at the moment. He's right here. For now, I'm going to enjoy every minute of it. Yes, every minute. And then I'll give him back to his mum and dad, just like I promised. Never mind. It's been lovely. And um, who knows, maybe he'll save hard enough to come back another time. Bye for now. See you next time. Next movie. What was it again? Ah yeah, Madurodam.